So here is everything we got from HEB. We also had to make a Walmart stop and I'll show you why in just a second. So we were doing all of our grocery shopping at HEB and they did not have Halloween Funfetti stuff. So we ran to Walmart quick and picked it up. We've never got the chocolate one before. So we got it this time to try. We usually get the other one, but we always get this, the vanilla frosting. The other one is chocolate. So yeah, we got the chocolate Halloween Funfetti cake mix. We're gonna be making some cupcakes and then we got the vanilla orange frosting that comes with the sprinkles and then we picked these up as well so that was from walmart starting over here we got another roast because we're making mississippi roast again we have been making this a lot lately we eat on it for a few days it's so good if you've never tried it you should totally make it it is delicious and we serve it with mashed potatoes extra gravy and carrots we also got some chicken breast because alan wants some chicken alfredo that's his favorite we got some salted butter, lactose-free milk, heavy whipping cream, Italian cheese blend. We got some more salt and lime peanuts, some more Monterey Jack with jalapeno peppers, rotini pasta. Got some cinnamon spice oatmeal. Got some cornstarch. I use this for my dry shampoo, but I also use it to thicken things that I'm cooking if it needs it, but I mostly got it for the dry shampoo. Got some mini popcorn bags, some tin foil, ranch seasoning pack, this one, some mo honey peanut butter, this stuff is so good, so good. Um, we got some olive oil, pepperoncini peppers. We got three of these for the girls, but as soon as we walked in, we told them what we got them. So we had to give them one of them. Um, Cookie and Cannoli likes this one, the Heritage Ranch by H-E-B chicken and pumpkin recipe, while Kiki prefers um, the Friskies can shredded. So we got her one of those, she's eating it now. We got some baby carrots, some eggs, some dishwasher packs. Uh, this was actually on sale for a dollar something. Apple cinnamon donut dish soap. It smells really good. Finally, after I don't know how long, I finally got a new thing of primer. Ah, all of the beauty stuff was 25% off at HEB. So I grabbed this. We grabbed some of this apple cider and vinegar conditioner. This is Allen's. It smells really good. Got this one for me. Damage repair. My hair has been really dry lately, especially with the weather changing. It's the Suave Coconut Oil Infusion. And yeah, that's everything we got from HEB and then our little Walmart haul. So I hope you enjoyed it. So now it's the next morning and it's raining as you can see. I'm having my first cup of coffee. I just woke up and I'm also preparing my Mississippi roast. I borrowed my mom's slow cooker for this. I'm really excited to try it this way. I've never used one before. And now that everything is done, I'm gonna wipe off the countertops quick. This is not going to be a cleaning video because I feel like I've posted way too many cleaning videos lately. So I figured I would switch it up a bit. I just wanna tell her how I feel, scream it out loud. Have you ever been in love? Have you ever lost your head? Have you felt like you were out of breath when you saw her in that dress? When your heart is beating fast and you're sweating and you can't stop looking at her smile, then you've been in love. That's how you know you've been in love. So after that, I took a quick shower and now it's time to brush my teeth. I'm using the Hello Charcoal Toothpaste and my water flosser, putting a little Dove deodorant on, and this is my before look, and this is the after. And then I'm gonna put some products in my hair and brush it out, blow dry it a little, and curl it, and then we're gonna do a try on. And I, I really get what the love songs are talking about. So now it's time for a little try on. All of these clothes are from Amazon and will be listed down below. The first thing I'm trying on is this tan sweater dress. It is so soft and comfy and warm. It's perfect for fall and winter. I love the fit of it and the length and the design of the front and the chest area. This dress would be so cute with any kind of shoes, but I could see it being worn with some cute tan or black boots, but I definitely love this dress. Next up is this two-piece outfit. It's black and white. It has stripes down the side. It's super soft and comfy, something you could wear as an outfit or pajamas if you choose. It has a drawstring and pockets, and you could switch up the shirt too in the summer. You could wear it with a little cami, some slides, boots, or tennis shoes. Definitely a year-round outfit for me. Next up is these super cute jammas. I cannot wait to wear these this winter. I'm going to be so comfortable. The material is so soft. The shirt is long-sleeved and has a pocket in the front and the pants have pockets as well. I also love the pattern on these pants and I think these jammies are super cute. 
Next up is this gorgeous blue velvet dress. Again, perfect for fall and winter. It's such a soft, velvety material, very comfortable. But I'm not sure if I like the fit on me, but I do love this dress in general, especially the sleeves. That is my favorite part of this dress and the little tie too. I really wanted to love this next dress on me, but I feel like it's just too big on me, but I am in love with this mustard color. I love the sleeves on this dress. I do love how flowy it is, and it is a bit more modest than the other dresses, but I'm just not sure about the fit on me, so let me know your thoughts down below. But I do love this color, and I think it's perfect for this season. Next up, we got another set of jammies. These are super silky and soft. It has a little pocket on the front of the shirt and pockets in the pants as well. And I got these in this beautiful icy blue color. These jammies made me feel kind of fancy. I don't know why, but they look kind of fancy to me. <laughs> And next up, I got a new set of onesie pajamas. These can be worn as pajamas or loungewear, totally up to you, but I love the pattern. It's black with white stars. It zips up in the front. It's super comfy and has a hood. I'll definitely be wearing this all winter because y'all know I hate the cold. I'm always freezing, and this is definitely gonna keep me warm. Next up is another sweater dress, and I got this one in black, and I'm kind of obsessed with this one. First off, it's a sweater material, so it's super, super, soft it's nice and warm and form-fitting and flattering in my opinion I love the length of this dress and I love the sleeves on it I also love the little tie in the front as well Next up is a shirt, and Alan picked this one out for me. It's a black tank top, and it's covered in black sequins. It's super shiny, so cute, very early 2000s style. I love the double straps in the front and the back of the shirt as well. And next up, I got a new black cardigan. I don't know why I wear so much black when I have white haired cats that shed like crazy but maybe I'm the crazy one but black is my favorite when it comes to clothes so I guess I'll just have to invest in the world's biggest lint roller but yeah I love this cardigan I think I got it in gray as well a few months back it has pockets and it's very comfy. Next up is this super sassy black suede jacket. I love the zippers on it. It has pockets. It's a nice soft suede material and it had me feeling like I was on the set of the movie Grease, which is why I was doing a little dancing, but I love this jacket. It's so cute and like I said, it's super sassy and you could wear this with anything. Next up is this winter coat, and this one is Alan's favorite. He said it is the nicest coat he has seen in a while. I am in love with it also. I love the pattern, but I love that it's a peplum style. I love anything that has that peplum design. I find it so flattering and cute. It has pockets and buttons. You can wear it buttoned or unbuttoned, up to you. And it has a little tie around it as well. And now I have an extra surprise for y'all. Alan is actually gonna do a little try on himself. So the first thing he has on here is a black button up men's sweater. I love this sweater on him. It's very soft, it has pockets and buttons. And again, you can wear it buttoned or unbuttoned, but I think it looks great on him either way. Next up is this blue sports jacket. I love him in these types of jackets paired with a pair of jeans. I just think it looks so good on him and I love this color. It has pockets as well and this can be worn with dress pants or jeans. Totally up to you. But next is my favorite on him, this blue dress shirt. He is wearing a black v-neck under it which is how he would usually wear a shirt like this but of course you can wear it without and also this can be worn with jeans or dress pants. Totally up to you but I think he looks so good in this color and in this shirt. Next up, I wanted to show y'all these gifts I got in the mail from my friends Jesse and my friend Vicky. So Miss Vicky got this for the girls. It's a brush for their hair. It's very well made. It's from Amazon. It's all white and all you do is brush them and then with the push of a button, it releases the hair. The girls love being brushed, so they're going to enjoy this so much. Thank you, Miss Vicky, for their gift.
Next up, my friend Jesse actually handmade this stuff. The first thing we have here is this adorable keychain. It is the softest thing I've ever felt, and it's so stinking cute. And then she also made me this head warmer headband, and it's in my favorite color, light pink. It's so soft, and she also made me this infinity scarf. Thank you so much, Jesse, for my stuff. I love it all. And we also made our cupcakes today, and they turned out delicious, as always. The roast is still in the slow cooker. It's got about four more hours to go, so I probably won't show the end result, but this is the end of the video, and I wanted to say thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch it. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye!